Jj YouTube, it's your boy Beast yet again. Um, I was asked uh, by quite a few people what actual loadout do I use for uh, my healing. Um, on any given day, I typically um, do twice the amount of heals than uh, the other healer that we have in there for the elite raids. Um, I typically only run elite raids because those are the ones that are more challenging and they're a little bit more fun for me. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and take you guys through what I actually use myself. Right? So, first things first, you always want to want to see what my stats look like. I only have a measly 392 uh, skill points, but uh, I've actually specced down a hybrid um, critical healing chance, uh, full critical healing magnitude, full um, restoration as max as it could be. Um, and I want you guys to see where my restoration lies by itself naturally. 49,998. Um, not bad. Um, uh, about regular, to be honest. Um, you'll find anywhere between uh, 47 and 52. Um, that's 1,000. Um, restoration, so I'm kind of right in between there, uh, right in the middle of that bunch. Um, now let's take you guys through my loadout. Um, if you're a healer and you don't run um, a priority heal, you're not really a healer. <laughs> um, especially because you have tanks that are they're taking a lot of damage and um, they're trying to keep them off the group, especially when you run elite raids. Um, and if you don't have something to kind of get them back to where they need to be so they don't die, um, you're not doing your job. Uh, of course, you got to run Admonish, which is the only qu classified group heal. Um, so you got to run that. Um, I run Blessing. Uh, I run Victorious Light. I also run Consume Soul. And I run Guardian's Light. Um, as you can tell within there, I do not run a Supercharge. Um, I would if I were. Uh, I used to run uh, a Sacrifice, but they've actually changed the Supercharge cost to you know a full bar. Um, as opposed to a 50 um, so there's no need to run that um, sorry DPS is that I don't run I a Gemini um, but I am going to take you guys to what I do run so um, if you're a healer you know that there's at least two cards that are a must transformation card and page of destiny um, and this is the reason why you have to run a group heal okay when a group heal heals a player above 40%, it places a stack of revive by uh, on them. Max stacks is 10 for 30 seconds. Refreshes during duration uh, for existing stacks. So, long story short, um, this you're spamming your admonish um, as frequently as possible. Um, specifically, you don't have to run the um, back out a little bit. You don't have to run the full combo to get it but I always run the full combo because it actually gives you a heal over time um, some people actually decide they don't want to run um, consume soul because then there's no need for it um, uh, beg to differ um, I, I could take off the uh, orb of Orion this is what I this is the third one um, and run strategist but the fact of the matter is, is that um, it's just not as effective when you're um, running uh, like I said, elite content, you need to get your, your tank up to where they need to be. Um, so this is just my preference. Again, it's not one shoe fits all. It's not one size fits all. It's one of those things where it's just the best thing for me. Best situation that I go. Alright? Um, so again, this is your main. Your admonish. Then you run right into consume. So, um, so both of those give you a heal over time. And the reason why you run those pretty much back to back. Back to back. Now, as you see, my hit, my actual power is going down uh, pretty significantly. But when you actually have a um, a troll, you you won't see that. Um, and again, uh, depending on what's going on, because your tank typically would juggle them as well, uh, juggle your ads, you wouldn't actually have to spam these back to back to back to back. It's just not it's not what you would do. And uh, please, 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 because I actually want a healer. Um, I actually want a troll rolled out as well, which I'll be sharing with you guys as well. Um, it, be nice on your trolls. <laughs> they are underappreciated too far. Um, but literally, um, so when you run it, you run that. And then as they're kind of doing their thing, I mean, especially when you're running ads, there's no need for you to do more than that. Um, unless someone 
You know, that's because you always have them. You have your precision DPS who think that they're, you know, above all and they're in the middle of the ads. Um, sometimes if you want to teach them a lesson, you can let them die. Uh, but, <laughs> but just while you're in there, uh, run that. And then if they're getting hammered, you're going to go right into Victorious Light. Um, in doing that, Victorious Light does more than what it needs to do, especially to get uh, get your, your entire group back up to par. Um, I only run the uh, Guardian Light when there's a lot going on and you can't help, you can't help everyone. Um, so when you run that, it's one of those things where your heal over time it kind of sits there, and it's a, it's one of those things where it kind of spams heals. Um, so very 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 useful, especially when you're coming down to running uh, elite content. Um, this is why I again I don't run a supercharge. Um, there's no need. Um, so. Uh, with that being said, this is actually going to be one of those quick videos. It's very simple, very easy to load out. Uh, what I will do is attach a, uh, a link down below for you to go through and just kind of see some of the elite content that I've run. Um, so you can just kind of see what it will look like um, when you're running this in actual elite content. Um, I might even do CTE. Because uh, FBE is one of those things where um, if you're running this, you can solo FBE without a doubt. Um, of course, if you pay attention to mechanics <laughs> and you have a group that's not a bunch of idiots as well um, but you can easily solo um, you know some of the hardest raids um, hardest elite content whether whether it be PCE DME um, FBE um, and even I mean you may think it's crazy CTE which is clock tower elite but you guys um, take a peek like I said like I always say um, hit that like button for me um, smash that subscribe button and I'll uh, bring you guys more wonderful videos as soon as possible. Until next time, see ya.